All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have Rami versus Fat Mouse. Should be a good one. Fat Mouse is a seasoned veteran. Rami, an up and coming but very aggressive noob. And getting the map scouted out. Randy's got two refineries down. Looks like Ray is going to go for some type of fast tech. In the APC, we've seen Trooper do this. APC full of bombers. Anti scouts stop the entrance from green. Rammy going full economy. <laughs> Pulling his men back as he's seen this APC. He probably doesn't know what's in it. Wants to meet in the middle. Looks like it's gonna get through. Sure, he got a power plant that will slow him down. And it opens up the middle of his base. I'd say he's not, not fully scouted. And what started out as I thought was going to be a fast tech, now he's just going back into economy, but he's already got his war down. As of right around now, I'd say their economies are equal, but Ray has a war factory. Ramy's sending his infantry rush down a little late, I'd say, at this point. But it looks like he has more infantry. Of course, you can always squash him with those harvesters, and he most certainly will. Range Base going. Looks like he's getting teched up. Now oh, oh, this is a bit aggravating. Oh, oh, that's the deal. Oh, 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 and both of them need to make sure it works. Frankly, they didn't get much. rush not worthwhile other than the fact that it opened him up I think his money could have been spent in better places than that because one jump jet would have opened that entire base up without the massive loss of infantry putting some early pressure Going to send what he has. Looks like gold is now fully teched and bringing out the MK. He's got to get that service depot so he can make a carry all. I'd say his economy is doing okay. Bringing out a bomber for some defense. He doesn't have much of anything else. Orange wants to keep that radar for some reason. Usually they sell it, so he's going to tech up here. Now Rami has some solid defense for that in cave. Orange is his tech. I just saw a bomber pop up. He's putting some Sams up. Get your defense. Against bombers and the MK, as he now goes in. 
for a close battle. Ramy coming in from behind with an impaired. But it looks like Orange is dealing the damage here. And the almost stock is in case. Certainly has him on the ropes now. And cut Green's defense and offense down to a fair minimum. back to Orange's base. He's got the MK out. Defense is, well, I'd say, well spread out here as well as his economy. He's going to work with the bombers, getting rid of those bad sites. He's now in trouble. We're going to see a MK confrontation here. And Green is going to win it. This is not good for Orange. It's never good to lose an MK. Now he's sending the Disruptor out, spreading out his Titans. Looks like he's, his face is in very good condition here. Has had no pressure except for the pathetic infantry rush at the beginning of the day, which did nothing. Now he touches down that disruptor, and I think that could very well be just to let Green know that there is a disruptor in the area. It's a psychological play, and Ray Mouse is a master of psychology when it comes to my period son. And he goes in now, taking out an easy refinery, Green Cell, trying to get one of his and with the MK. And we lose the Disruptor! What at what cost? Green! Now Green sending his MK down. Once again, a sortie of bombers makes its way to the Green side. There is no EMP yet. Green's gonna have his fun and tell the arrival of the MK. as he lost his carry-all and no way of retreating. And now it is Orange putting the pressure back, sending his MK. He better watch it, for the EMP is ready to strike at any moment, assuming it is fully charged. on those bomber rooms and very much needed. Bomber pads on the back side of the base. Now Green is going to have to re-attack if he wants to make more bombers. Or that is his way to this point. And he must be very weary of the EMP at the front of his base. Or now, expanding to the next Tiberium patch while sending another wave of Titans. He has another wave ready to go in the back, which will also serve as defense. Should Green be successful in putting any pressure, but he so far has not, and he misses the EMP. Now he has no EMP, it will take 90 seconds to recharge that EMP. Orange's Titans will make it time to put additional pressure with his legs by the MJ. Titans are Orange now moves into the 